Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Are court-ordered payments tax deductible? Ah, the world of taxes. It's a labyrinth of rules, regulations, and fine print that can often leave us scratching our heads. Today, we're diving into a question many people ask. Are court-ordered payments tax deductible? Now, wouldn't it be nice if the answer was a simple yes or no? But like most tax-related queries, it's not that straightforward. The deductibility of court-ordered payments depends on the nature of the payment. Let's start with alimony payments. Prior to 2019, alimony payments were tax deductible for the payer and taxable to the recipient. However, the Tax Cuts and Jobs Act changed that. For divorce or separation agreements executed or modified after December 31, 2018, alimony is no longer tax deductible for the payer, nor is it taxable to the recipient. But what about child support payments? These are never tax deductible. The IRS considers these payments as a personal expense. Fines and penalties? Unfortunately, they're not tax deductible either. The IRS is quite clear that any fines or penalties paid to a government for the violation of any law are not deductible. Now let's talk about legal fees. In some cases, they can be tax deductible, but it depends on why you incurred them. If they're related to doing or keeping your job, producing or collecting taxable income, or getting tax advice, they could be deductible. Well, there you have it. Like most things tax-related, the answer to whether court-ordered payments are tax-deductible is, it depends. To learn more, check out these links which you can click in the description below, and feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe, and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.